She thinks she can just throw them at you. Get him, Chelsea, get him. Whoa, good girl. Nice one. Hey, that's Mike and Holly, Alex, Eddie, and Kelsey. Open the door for mommy. Ready? <laughs> pillow fight! Alex has been wanting a new pillow, and I had found, I know, I had found these really comfortable pillows at Kohl's, they're by, it's just fuzz. They're, yeah, they're um, Chaps brand is what they are, and then they sell for like, they go on sale for like 20 bucks, which is really reasonable, and they're so... Yeah, they're so squishy and soft, and guess what? What? I got one for you, too. Yeah! <laughs> All right, so both of you guys are going to have soft, squishy new pillows because they were on sale, and Mommy had a coupon, and I bought one for myself like a month ago, and I love it, and it's called Down Alternative, so it's not down feathers. Like I didn't like the feathers because they smell kind of funny, and sometimes they'll poke you in the face. And so this is nice because it's just like a really soft, squishy, I don't even know what it is. So I got it at Kohl's, it's by Chaps, and it's the yellow label, so it's me like medium thickness or medium size or something like that, I don't know, but, <laughs> Alex. Oh, Ed's like, wait, I want a pillow too, guys. <laughs> well, like he doesn't just, hey, 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 not the sheets. Yeah, I gotta go take it out of the package. Look at What? I got my new pillow in too. So I'll we'll have new pillows to sleep on tonight, huh? Thank you. Yay. Oh, you're so welcome. Thank you. I thought I'd go ahead and show you guys the package it came in. So it's by Chaps Beyond Down and it's the premium down medium support. We all love I gotta take it out of the package first, miss. <laughs> Little miss wants to try her new pillow. I said, all right, <laughs> I'm okay with that. Here we go. She's like, gotta get rid of the old one. Don't need that no more. Right? <laughs> we need to find you a new pillowcase for that one. Oh my, oh, it's pretty poofy compared to your old one. What do you think? Good. It's good? Yeah. Nice and squishy, nice and yeah. soft? Yeah. All right. I think I need a pillowcase for that. Yeah, we need to find you a pillowcase. Hey, we found splashlings. Oh, a splashling. We found a treasure. We were playing with the splashlings in the little treasure box this morning. Okay, so I was going to go outside to show you guys something. And Michael, I opened the door to step out, and Michael's like, um, it's pouring. I didn't even realize. The wind is really bad, and it's pouring. What I wanted to show you guys is these buckets were empty yesterday afternoon because I was going to clean them, and I just left them there. They are all like, can you see the water lines on them? That's just from the rain that we got last night, and obviously more rain is coming from the hurricane. So a lot of people are dealing with some flooding issues. We don't have any flooding issues where we are at. What? Oh, Daddy put them away. But that's how much water we've gotten already. It's probably about six inches or so, I would say. Let the real packing commence. <laughs> Michael just wow. at dinner time was like, all right, guys, here's what we need to do. We need to start packing. And I was like, okay. And then he comes in with boxes and starts grabbing things. <laughs> and I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know we okay. need to start packing her, right now. Her room is going to be probably the most difficult because the closet's loaded. Okay, all of our games that we play like on a regular basis, like the ones that Chelsea really likes or the ones that we like as a family, go in Alex's closet so they're easily accessible and then we can just grab, more, grab what we want out of the closet and sit down and play. So I set aside a few games that we play like every day with Chelsea. I sit down and we play games every day. She loves to play games. So I put her favorites aside and the rest of them can be packed. But this closet is just packed full of games and puzzles and books and you name it. So <laughs> these two are kind of, we're working on this little shelf. Did I say it's we're just, three weeks away? <laughs> three weeks. 
A lot of you guys have asked. It's going to be busy, busy, busy. We're going to be busy. It's yeah. Gonna happen, a lot of you guys have asked, when are you moving? When are you moving? We are moving like the last week of September. The house will be done and we'll be ready to close because, like, um, once the house is finished, you have to like sign all the papers. That's called closing. And then we get the keys. And then that following week, the last week of September, um, we'll be moving in. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> we didn't accomplish much, but it's a start. <laughs> Shelves cleared. Alex started to tackle the desk. We started to tackle the closet. I think Michael underestimated just how big of a task this really is. Well, like, no, because I know it's a lot, but we don't have to do it like in a weekend. No, but... We got time to do it. Yeah, we have time. It's just, there's so much stuff. Their whole lives are in this house. Our whole lives are in this house. And it's like, oh, you made a basket. <laughs> yeah, it's so we've got three weeks still. A <laughs> little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little we bit. Just did, what, maybe an hour's worth? And I'm yeah. like, oh my gosh. And this is just like this little area. And again, we still have a ton to do in just here alone. Whoosh. <laughs> Okay, so you guys are definitely going to get some wind noise. We are probably a couple hours away from where the big storms are going on. But as you can tell, just even that far away, we're getting some winds. Like, we're done with the rain. It's pretty gloomy. But we're not going to get any more rain. There, <laughs> there's the rain we got. So, it, it filled up the bucket about halfway. So, we got quite a bit of rain. So now we're just kind of getting the tailwinds from like the way, way outside of the storm. So it's just going to be a little windy. Ed can actually go outside and go potty now. Good boy. <laughs> so yeah, just a little bit. We get gusts of winds and that's about it. You can see up there, the clouds are moving still pretty good. She's bailing. Give me your best shot. Oh! If she didn't duck, that would have got her. Now pull it. Pull. 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 <laughs> that face. There you go. Good job. Whoa! I saw that. It was like that close to Alex's ear. Nerf Wars! I don't have a gun now, though. I need it. Alex got the blaster. I need this. What are you waiting for? Oh, oh I hit Chelsea instead. <laughs> no, not the child. It's time for the question of the day. Today's question comes from Yarialis Morales. And the question is, if you had to pick only one superpower, what would it be? So here's my question that Michael will probably have to answer. Is this like your average superpower? like? being able to fly and be strong like Superman, being fast like Flash, or can we make up any superpower? Well, any power, superpower you can make up probably does exist in some superhero somewhere. I Go don't ahead. know. Let's see what you well, got. my answer would be the power to heal the sick. So like if anybody was sick or hurt or had something wrong with them to be able to heal them. So like miraculous healing. <laughs> 
I don't think that's a Trying superpower in anybody. Think. And like, I don't know if that counts because I think there, it's there's not a like superhero somewhere here or there that can. I mean, I'm not you. saying climb like Spider Man, fly like you know. I'm not saying like your average thing. There's, I bet there is. If you Google, it, there's probably a superhero that has that. Superpower. Okay, well, that would be the superpower that I would want. If that's like stretching it too far beyond, then I would say be like Superman and be able to fly and still be strong and save people. No. You could still save people. What does the question say? Only one. Oh, only one superpower? <gasps> mm. Would you rather fly or be strong? Which one would be more helpful to others? Probably being strong. Being super strong. Oh, I don't know. This is hard. I was going to pick flying, but... I mean, really? What How can is you that? Do with flying? Yeah, like that's what I was trying to I'm think. I'm gonna go with speed, flash. Because flash can technically kind of fly-ish. Like he, he can, can walk on water. Yeah, and he can run up buildings, and he can leap pretty far. So I mean, just imagine being able to do stuff fast. Like you see the stuff he does. He rescues a whole building full of people before it like collapses or oh, catches yeah. on fire or something. Oh, so that's that but would be more useful, useful than flying, yeah. Cause like I don't... the stuff he does just to screw with people is pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with Spider Man, because it it's kind of a very useful thing. So you can climb up buildings and you can stick to stuff, and then if you need to like save someone, you can swing in on a thread and you kick the bad guy. Out. You know, you can I'm trying. Like I'm trying in. to imagine Alex as Superman oh. or as, um, <laughs> what's it called? Spider Man. Spider Man. <laughs> so we want to know from you guys if you could only, if you had to pick only one superpower, what would it be? Tell us in the comments below.